I don't know what happened in the design process of that. Something has gone wrong. One just to win and you're, you're done for. Hello guys. So I haven't really posted in a while and it's time to get back into it. So I have a haul and it's a That's So Fetch haul if you didn't already see it by the title. And I don't believe I've ever shopped off here before. Like I've definitely seen it come up on my thing all the time. I've looked on there but I've just never bought anything. And I was like, you know what, let's just try it. It was like the after payday sales. I was like, frick it, let's just try this brand. I have bought a fair few things so let's just get into it. Alrighty, we have the first item on. Firstly, I will just say that the shipping on this was extremely fast. I honestly was surprised when it came because I was like, how did it get here so fast? So that was really good and it was free because of obviously how much I spent. Alrighty, so here is the first dress on. I love the pink on this. I think it's such a pretty pink color. I'm not sure if like the camera will pick it up like how it's looking like in person. However, the one thing that's really annoying me is this is like the sticky bit here and it keeps rolling over like it won't stay on my skin. That is almost like ruining the whole thing for me because I feel like you're just gonna keep being like fiddling with up here. Yeah, I literally just cannot get it to stay. I would have to like sticky it myself. It does come up like a pretty good length from behind though, which is good because a lot of these dresses tend to be way too short, which is the, obviously this is short, but like it's still covering everything. Like I wouldn't be like too worried about it. I did get it in a 14 or an extra large and it does fit, which is amazing. Sometimes they can run like too small still. So I paid, I think it was six $64.99 and then take $19.50 off which is the 30% so whatever that is like what 45 or something but 45 is still kind of, if you didn't have the discount this would be $65 and to be honest I would not pay $65 for this this is just annoying me the material is not too bad and stuff but it's I don't know so I'm just not like obsessed with it it's it's cute it's not like wow it's not like a wow factor dress it's just cute i don't know in the mirror it looks better than probably on camera 65 is probably not for me so we will try on the next item now so i would really love to show you guys everything properly i might need to put something on hang on i might put something on underneath so i can show you i actually will be i'm falling out of this top and these pants don't do up so we're off to a really good start with these two um, okay, I'm gonna put something on underneath. <laughs> okay, I know this looks really stupid, but this is the only way to like show you guys the top. As you can see, it doesn't fit. Like, I can get it on, but like if you're a size 14, I feel like for the most part, you're probably gonna have a bit of boob on you. Like maybe not everyone, but I feel like there's gotta be something there if you're a size 14. And this is honestly like for an A cup. Like, I'm not even taking the piss. Like, that to me is for like someone who's like an A or a B. I just feel like for a size 14 top, that is not the cup size. Like, I don't know what happened in the design process of that, but something has gone wrong. I don't even have this on. I feel like I can't breathe. Um, and yeah, obviously these pants don't do up. Like, I'm not going to try because like, they're not, they're not. They're not happening. Yeah, this is a bit of a messy one. I don't know what's going on here. Honestly, the quality is just not doing it for me. Even if it did fit, I don't think I'd be that obsessed. Like, I have pants that are similar to this. They're just very, like, in and not that, like, heavy weighted sort of pant, if that makes sense. So this top is $47.99. <laughs> with my di like with the discount it would have been still like $33. Um I don't think it's worth that. Bro, in the photo, in the photo it actually fits her like I know they do this stuff but it's just like what the hell? I just don't understand. I'll have the photos up so you can see. Oh my god. Like she's definitely got bigger boob. Not not the me uh, this whole thing is just confusing to me. Oh, and the pants were $70. No. No, really sorry about that, but they're not. They're not $70. I'm just editing this now and I can't believe that those are the same pair of pants. Like I'm actually shook. Like what the hell has gone on here? 
Like I definitely have Kmart ones which are literally the same for like 25. I don't really want to like bash the whole thing but like the only thing that's like winning at the moment is the express shipping and how vast it was. Okay guys so I did in fact order these pants and I can't actually put them on and show you guys because they don't fit. So unless my whole downstairs is out for you i can't show you unfortunately it's always the thighs for me like things just don't tend to go past there sometimes but like when you order a 14 you kind of want a 14. what a shame i actually like really liked these on the model but yeah they were just like these pink cute cargo pants they were gonna be a vibe but the vibe has been shut down yeah i don't think their sizing is really suited for my body type which is amazing we really love that these were a no these were 70 dollars cute yeah, and then it would have been $20 off, so like 50 bucks. But that's how only if you got it 30% off, which is not all the time. So otherwise, retail original price is $70, which I don't think that they are. Like, I definitely have felt better quality pants for $70, and they obviously don't fit. So, with all that in mind, these are a no, um, but we tried. We tried and we failed. I will have the camera down just like this while I quickly show you. Cute. Um, they are quite long. I don't know if that's supposed to be the vibe, um, but they definitely fit, so that's great. <laughs> so I'm glad these ones fit. They they do feel quite soft. I will give them that. This seems to be like their more bestsellers off their website, but they're definitely the same. I feel like everyone does this style now with the raised bubble writing on the side here. It just says on the side there, that's so fetch. It is a cute like bone color i do like it i'm not sure if i'm obsessed with them either though like i don't know if it's the color for me like on my skin tone this isn't like their sort of fault this is just like i don't think i like this on me but i don't know if they're a bit long like i know that can be the style but i feel like they're just a bit too long no okay she's got it on like that too i think that's their style is to have like a lot of excess down the bottom here. These were 60, then take 17.99 off. So they would have been like 40. I think these ones do look like the model compared, obviously they fit. I feel like the pricing of these ones are pretty like good compared to the other things. I think the quality of these ones are better. They're really soft inside. They're thick, but they're not too thick. Like I actually like the feeling of these. Like they're really quite comfortable to be honest with you. This is probably the best thing so far is these pants, um, just in terms of quality and fit and all of that. I would say that these are the winners so far, a pair of track pants. So, <laughs> Okay, so definitely spicing things up a little bit. This dress is giving me Shein vibes purely for the quality. It's supposed to be that like slinky sort of, you know how that like slinky sort of bathery sort of material? That's what it's supposed to be like, but it's just not. It feels like this feels cheap, like whatever price it was, I'm sure it's definitely not the right one. <laughs> this is just like not good quality unfortunately the actual style of the dress i love it's got like the ruching here and then the cutouts on the side it's just doing the most me <laughs> but the back i'm really sorry but that is not enough coverage for my bum i just feel like i'm just if i bent over you'd see everything in a second and if one one gust of wind mate and one gust of wind and you're you're done for if i pull it down anymore then the, the other side's gonna pop out like it's just not gonna work but the actual style of this is cute i love like the tie up back detailing i love that it's a halter i love the cutouts the only thing like really ruining it for me is the quality and obviously the fact that it just covers me bum yeah if it was a bit cheaper I would say that it's worth it for like the beach just because the quality is not all that great and like it, it wouldn't matter if it got like wet or anything like that. Oh, <laughs> no way that is the price. $70. No, 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 no. If you paid $70 for this, I feel like you would be like, what the hell have I actually paid for? <laughs> Like, this is definitely giving Shein and definitely giving cheap. I'm really sorry. I feel like I am shit 
shitting all over this brain right now, but like I'm you can't charge that for this quality. Like you just can't. I just don't know what's going on. Even with the discount 21 or even 50. No, I'm not paying $50 for this. Like I'm just not. That's a shame. This is a this it actually looks really nice online. And I was like, I thought I'd really like it. I do think I like this shape for my body. I actually think it's doing a lot. Not like some of the other things where it's doing not a lot. What a shame the quality is not better. Otherwise, I would honestly rate this one a lot higher. Okay, on camera, this is doing nothing for my stomach. Like, actually accentuating the shit out of it. But okay, whatever. This one does fit. It's a bit of a tighter fit than that yellow one we had. No, the pink one that we had on at the... Is this recording? The pink one that we had on at the start. But it's more of that like linen-y sort of material. I think this one's probably up there with one of the better items that we have tried on just in terms of like fit. It's not doing that whole roll down thing like I could actually wear this out but I'm just like not obsessed to be honest I don't know if this is it's probably not the right dress for me personally it does fit really nicely like it definitely covers everything like I don't feel like I'd be worried too much about my ass coming out or anything like that what was the price this one was 65 and then take the 1950. I do think this is the one of the things that is like better price and probably more worth the price. I'm just not obsessed with it for me. The color is so cute though. I really love the yellow. Um, really nice like summery dress. It is double lined and everything like that too. I actually don't know if this is fitting me properly because this is kind of like pulling here. Like I don't know if it was supposed to be a bit looser towards the thigh region do you know when it's like comes in tight but like loosens a bit i think it was supposed to do that but my thick thighs prevented that from happening I'm not vibing this one unfortunately so that is everything from that's so fetch i definitely haven't ordered from here before i don't know if it's gonna be somewhere i order from again only maybe for like a youtube video just because Honestly, the sizing was not it for me. There was more things that didn't fit that did. The quality is not it for me for the price. Even with that being 30% off, I still feel like it's too much. Yeah, it's just not for me. I've definitely tried better brands, had better quality stuff, and yeah, I don't think I'll be buying from here again. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you, if you were about to buy off here, like this would give you some sort of insight. I don't know if it's like if people that are smaller have better luck if with sizing and stuff. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.